Hello guys, welcome back to my channel. Thank you so much for tuning in today. I am back with another vlog. You know it. So today I am doing some preparations for our Thanksgiving. Tomorrow is Thanksgiving, so this vlog is going to be uploaded a little bit later. I'm just going to show you what we're cooking this year since we don't have guests and it's only five of us. Plus kids don't really eat any Thanksgiving food anyway. So um, I'll just show you what I'm cooking. I'm going to cook some stuff today, some stuff tomorrow. And yeah. Just in case you're interested, let me know what your favorite meals for Thanksgiving are and also for Christmas. I'm very curious. So, you know, just going to keep it low-key this year. I'm cooking some stuff. I'm buying some stuff. So, yeah, if you want to see it, then please stay tuned. So, I'm going to start with my preparations for the dressing. I'm making a cornbread dressing. So, I'm actually uh, sauteing some onions and some... Um, what are those called? Celery. And I think it's about done because I already see like a tiny brown spot. So that's pretty much done. I already have a crumbled cornbread. I made it from scratch because it's super easy and I had some cornmeal left. So I have some seasonings over there. I have um, two eggs over there. I have the shallots. I have the chicken that I made in Instant Pot and I have the uh, chicken, what is it, like a stock from the chicken that I just made. So that is it, I'm just going to combine it all together. I'm going to make the dressing today and I'm going to make the roasted potatoes tomorrow. Um, besides that, I will, I'm making some like a chicken, like a turkey breast, but it's very easy. You just put it in the oven for three hours, so it already has all the seasonings in there. I'm going to do that tomorrow. Ham is going to be in the oven tomorrow because I was planning to buy honey, um, was it honey baked ham? But it was just too many people, so I gave up on that idea. I went to two, two stores and it was just too much. And as far as what I'm buying, I bought this pecan pie because, you know, I'm not dealing with all this pie making if it's just five of us. And I bought the rolls because I, I was planning to make the Hawaiian rolls because we have a bread machine, but with honey uh, with ham that I need to make it's just not going to be enough time and I actually have the pie in the oven it's already cooking it's just a frozen berry pie it's just for me and my mom I'll show it to you how it looks it's just a Marie Calendar frozen just want something easy but still kind of like homey meal for this Thanksgiving so yeah my mom just took kids to the park they're gonna be there for another hour or so because it's getting dark very early nowadays so yeah um yeah that's it and this is how my dressing looks like after i mixed everything all the ingredients together i tried the seasonings all right so we're just gonna put it in the oven for 350 uh bake it and then i'm going just to heat it up tomorrow good morning guys so this is the new day i'm continuing with my thanksgiving preparation so for turkey i'm cooking this little thing I got it, I think like every grocery store I went had it. But we cooked it last year, it's a boneless turkey breast and it's super easy, you just put it in the oven for 3 hours and it's ready, it's already seasoned and all. Um, and I also bought this smoked ham, I was planning to buy a smaller ham but that's all they had. Um, I don't think, I think it has like a brown sugar glaze packet inside but I think I'm just going to do my own recipe. It's actually a, not a recipe but like a directions from uh, my husband's family because he really likes um, how his mom and his niece makes ham so I'm just following their directions. We'll see how that turns out but yeah I'm uh, starting to cook. I have like three more meals to prepare which is uh, this turkey breast cooks for three hours, ham cooks for about I don't know hour and a half or so two hours maybe and then i also have the potatoes i'm just going to roast them because nobody really eats much of the mashed potatoes in this house i mean we do but you know kids don't so um yeah i'm a little tired it was like a rough morning but we managed anyway so just going to give a quick update how it is going so i just cut the ham and i sliced it and i actually uh, trimmed like most of the fat i uh put it on the on the bottom of this pan then I poured the uh, oh my goodness the brown sugar almost half of the bag on top and then the pineapple juice and then some honey and some black pepper 
this is not my recipe this is the my husband's niece recipe and he really likes it so we'll see how it turns out I'm going to cover it and I'm just going to put in the oven this is how the turkey is, is doing it's um, supposed to be cooked in this bag and the bag is supposed to inflate and that's should be ready in about two hours so it's been an hour and I'm actually well it's been actually an hour and a half uh, I'm starting to make some potatoes I'm cutting them with this kind of uh, triangular wedges this is the roasted recipe uh, potatoes I found from Laura Vitali on YouTube so I'm just cutting some potatoes I'm just going to roast them and then while they're boiling I'm going to boil them for like 10 minutes first um, and then I'm going to make this infused oil it's the olive oil with some um, with some rosemary and with some garlic so I'm going to infuse that just to heat it up a little bit and then I'm going to pour this oil over the potatoes when they're done this is how everything is looking so far so the ham I just took off the foil I heat it up with foil at first for like hour maybe I'm gonna take off the foil for the last 30 minutes the turkey breast and then I just put some stuffing to warm up I made it yesterday so I'm just heating it up with the foil on top and I already heat up some oil with rosemary and garlic so now it smells just like rosemary boiling some potatoes I'm going to bring it to the boil and boil it for like three to five minutes and then I'm going to toast it with this oil on this baking sheet and I already have some Hawaiian rolls I already have some uh, berry pie it, I got it frozen from the store and I baked, uh, baked it yesterday and then there is a pecan pie so we're pretty much all set so Jasmine is going to come over around 1 o'clock to pick up some ham because I promised her some ham because I was going to get some from Honey Baked Ham Company but that didn't happen so I'm making my own ham and she's going to pick some up um, and yeah I think we're going to have this um, this feast when the kids go to bed around 1 o'clock because they don't really eat any of this stuff I might save some uh, for them for dinner so we can try to give them some but I would not really get my hopes up they might eat they might eat a little bit of turkey I don't even know but it's very hard to make them try something so we'll see we'll see how it goes if uh, the food is ready and the kids are still eating I might give them some stuff to try so this is the plan don't mind my hairstyle so yeah keep in cooking just keep on cooking okay so our food is ready I got this potatoes they got a little bit too crispy but I think it's okay we have the turkey right here I just need to unpack it from this bag we got the stuffing dressing we got some ham so yeah we're ready to eat let's ready to eat, eat? alright let's eat ham <laughs> I'm recording you recording you recording me recording? okay got the ham and turkey and the dressing so this is how the plate looks like after all the manipulations with some ham some more yummy stuff these potatoes are pretty good but they're a little more crispy my mom does not understand the whole point about Thanksgiving <laughs> but she likes food <laughs> So yeah, and we got some pies over there. I'm gonna watch some movie, maybe. Or if it, what is it, Twilight? Um, zone. Twilight Zone. Twilight Zone Marathon. Marathon, yeah. So yeah, happy Thanksgiving, everyone. Mm -hmm.